That's, it's Pride Month. It's here. This is the thing. This is our time. We are going to do it. Hey guys, welcome to Why So Curious. Happy Friday. It's June already. So there's something like a giant elephant in the room. I have like forgotten the past, I don't know, like four weeks to say in the video. Why So Curious has reached a hundred plus subscribers. <laughs> That's not why I do this channel, but it's really, really encouraging to see that people are subscribing to the channel and watching the videos. The more people that watch, the more likely more people will be exposed to it. Um, and that is ultimately my goal, is to reach people who need these videos. So, thank you guys all so much, so, 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 so much for watching and for subscribing. And don't forget to keep sharing and spreading and watching and just being awesome, because you guys are so awesome. Thank you guys so much. There would be nothing without you guys. So, it would just be me talking to a camera, which is nothing new, but awkward. But it's LGBTQ Pride Month. Bam! In your face. The reason why it's Pride Month is because this is the month that Pride always happens on. Some of you are probably asking, what is Pride? What is it? Say what? What Pride? What? What is Pride? Guys, cool your beans. We were all fresh ones too. Thank you. Jesus. Pride is a celebration of the LGBTQ community, its culture, its effect on history, its impact on our society, and just celebrating the LGBTQ culture and its people. The last Sunday of June every year is celebrated around the country as Pride. It's turned into a month-long thing because these events happen all over the country, so they're not all gonna happen at the same time. Major cities around the United States and also around the world a little bit too, uh, celebrate Pride through their own festival celebration. Why does that happen? What? Why does Pride happen? I'm really excited about this video. <laughs> Back in June 1969, in the city of Manhattan, the Stonewall Riots happened. Now this is a huge, huge event. I don't want to fill you guys' brains too much with information today, so I'm going to talk about it next week, but you will learn about it. So, Stonewall Riots happened. Huge, crucial event for the LGBTQ community and for the movement in general. It really, like, put it out there, put it into the front line, and made things happen. Um, but that event sparked the nation, and a year after, on June 28th, 1970, the first ever parade was held in, in New York City, and it was called the Christopher Street Liberation Day. And it was the first ever Pride Parade to ever happen in the United States. Now from that moment, that became visible, a spark was lit in the United States, and major cities all over started to do their own Pride celebrations. Pride celebrations are a celebration of the people, the culture, the history, the movements, and the progress that has been made by LGBTQ people in history, in the country, even in the world. Also a uh, time to come together and talk about issues that are happening that we still need to fight for. It's also just being with people that are like you and celebrating who you are. There's also a lot of pretty people at Pride. Lots of pretty, there's lots of pretty people at Pride. Compose yourself, Mitch. No drool. Am I drooling? Okay, I'm good. So you've never been to a gay Pride parade? Hmm? Excuse me? Say what? Excuse me? That's okay. That's okay. That's okay. It really depends on where you are, what cities you're in, but like the basic outline of what will be in a pride celebration is there's always a parade, which is usually on that Sunday, the Pride Sunday. Um, and it, it features all of the like like LGBTQ organizations in that state, uh, people who are supporters. Here in Minneapolis, Loring Park is the destination for Pride. In Loring Park, there are booths set up around the entire park for organizations, companies, politicians, uh, businesses, support centers, public figures. If it has to do with our community or if they are supporters or whatever, they are gonna be in that park. There's also performers, performances, drag shows. Outside of the park, there are commonly things happening, celebrations happening at the bars and the clubs. Something that I forgot to mention in my update video last week, I can't believe I forgot this. The school group that I'm in, PRISM, you guys have seen them before. We have had the honor of carrying the traditional pride flag in the parade for the past two years. We are doing it again this year, and I am so pumped. We are walking in the parade, which is gonna be on the 26th, 
down Hennepin in Minneapolis. We are inviting everyone and anyone. If you wanna come join me and Prism in the parade and carrying the flag, send me your information, whether it's via the Facebook fan page for Why So Queerious, which I will post the link down below, or you can just post your email here or send me a direct message on YouTube. I will send you all of the information that you need in order to walk in the pride parade with us. That is an honor, like it has been one of the most amazing experiences I've ever had for the past two years, and I'm so happy I get to do it again. It is so much fun. I so, 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 so recommend that you come with. It's just a ball, and you get to be with me! <coughs> and it's gonna be a blast. It's gonna be a blast, and Pride is gonna be great. I'm really excited. I'm really excited for Pride, and uh, yeah. Do you guys like my awesome shirt? Unicorn muscle, bam! Sponsor me. Once again, you guys, thank you so much for subscribing. We reached a lot of subscribers on this channel and it would be nothing without you guys. So thank you so much for watching this video and all the other ones. Do not forget to share it with your friends. Tell everybody about Why So Curious because I'm brilliant. No, I'm not, I'm sorry. That was really big headed. I just like making these videos and I like sharing them with you guys. I like knowing that people are watching so that more and more people can be exposed to Why So Queerious if they need it. If you liked this video and would like to see more, please click the like button down below. If you are excited about a specific thing that's happening for Pride and you want me to know about it, comment it down below. I would love to hear. And if you would like to see more of my beautiful, beautiful, smiling, laughing face every Friday, please click the subscribe button down below. I love you guys so much. Mm, true. True, true, true. And I will see you next Friday. Bye!